While the previous governments had hesitated to touch the country's taxation system, the current BJP-led dispensation was making it more citizen-centric. Prime Minister Narendra Modi said on Wednesday, urging people to pay their dues for the development of India. He lamented that when a number of people did not pay tax and found ways to evade it, the burden fell on those who honestly paid their dues. Facebook-owned messaging platform WhatsApp announced yesterday that its worldwide user base has crossed the 2 billion mark. WhatsApp has now become the second application from Facebook to join the 2 billion users club and the second largest social media platform after its parent firm. As of December 31, 2019, Facebook had 2.5 billion active users. Retail inflation, calculated on the basis of Consumer Price Index, inched upwards to 7.59% during January, showed data released by the National Statistics Office yesterday. This is the highest rate of inflation since May 2014, when it was 8.33%. Amazon Chief Executive Jeff Bezos, the world's wealthiest person, has purchased a Beverly Hills mansion known as the Warner Estate from media mogul David Geffen for $165 million, a source familiar with the deal said yesterday. The sale price is believed to be the highest in a Los Angeles area residential real estate transaction. India Ratings and Research, a part of Fitch Group yesterday, downgraded Yes Bank's long-term issuer rating while maintaining it on rating watch negative. The rating downgrade was attributed to continued delay and inconclusive quantum of the anticipated equity infusion in Yes Bank. Microsoft Corporation Chief Executive Officer Satya Nadella is planning to visit India later this month, according to Reuters. Nadella is planning to be in India between 24th February and 26th February and will likely visit New Delhi Tech Hub Bengaluru and Mumbai. At least three Indians on board cruise ship Diamond Princess off Japanese coast have sent SOS appealing for help from the Indian government and Prime Minister Modi. The British Diamond Princess cruise ship carrying 3,711 people on board has been kept in quarantine off the coast of Yokohama, Japan. Of the people on board the ship, 266 are guests and 1,045 are crew members. Among them, 132 crew members and six passengers are Indian nationals.